guys I thought I'd do something a little bit different today and film a mini morning routine video for you uh, before I get into the vlog today so I'll insert that here and hopefully you guys enjoy it thanks for watching since I started bar prep, I've started getting up at 7 a.m. every day, put my glasses on because I'm blind without them, and get out of bed. Put my slippers on because my feet get cold. And I look outside to see what the weather's like. Today it happened to be nice, actually. Eloise is always very happy that I finally woke up, and she wants me to put her laser on for her. first thing I always do when I wake up is make myself a cup of coffee. I find that one, it gives me something to look forward to to get out of bed, and two, gives me that nice boost of caffeine that I need in the morning to start my day. I also just like having a warm drink in the morning, you know, like it wakes up my system, gets me going. Then I make my bed. I'll admit I don't do this every single day, but every time I do do it, it makes me feel more organized and ready to start my day. Turn my fairy lights on to create an ambiance. Ooh, look at that ambiance I've created. Wow. Then I take my coffee that I just made and bring it to my desk in my bedroom where I'll edit my YouTube videos for around an hour before I start studying. I only do this if I have time in the morning, today I happen to have time, but I like to start studying by 9 o'clock, but if I don't have time in the morning, I'll edit my YouTube videos after I'm done studying at the end of the day. And today I even had time to play a little bit of guitar, so that's what I did. I think it's nice to do something for yourself in the morning. Um, it just makes you feel better about the day ahead and it's nice to just block out even like five minutes to do something that's just for you and not related to work in the morning before you start your day. Even if it's something like just reading or watching YouTube videos or doing anything that you personally enjoy. Wanna grab a hold of that little songbird Take her for a ride to the top of the world right now Nice rendition, Erin. Then it's time for me to take a shower. And after I take a shower, I put my Olay moisturizer on, which is my favorite moisturizer. Brush my hair out. And then I use Johnson's Baby Creamy Oil, which is the only moisturizer that doesn't irritate my skin. I love this sunscreen. I use this sunscreen every day, and it's actually not gross feeling on your face. I have two pimples on my face today, which is good. Cover them up with Tarte Shape Tape Concealer all over my face, basically, but especially covering those pimples. Bare Minerals Bare Pro, also one of my faves. Then I use Clinique Blush and Dandelion Highlighter, which is just a nice subtle highlight. My Naked Palette, which is basically destroyed at this point, and some eyeliner. Mascara is the most important for me because my eyelashes are basically clear, so it makes them visible. And I love this Glossier Brow Gel. I use the clear one and Buxom Lip Cream. And I'm all done, yay! Next I do my hair, I blow dry it, then I style it, today I'm gonna curl it. Hair and makeup are done. Then I pick out my outfit for the day, Today I picked out this tank top which I got at PacSun a while ago. This necklace is from Urban Outfitters and my jeans are from Fashion Nova and I still have my slippers on from Marshalls. I love this perfume but they stopped making it. I'm so sad about it but my friend gave me her sample that she got a while ago. Then I eat a banana for breakfast and I sit down at my desk to start studying finally. 
that's my morning routine, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and on to the vlog for the day. Good morning, guys. It is bar prep day 11. I didn't film anything yesterday for day 10 of bar prep because I was basically just in my PJs all day um, studying like basically in my bed. <laughs> I had my videos playing on the TV back there and I was in my bed uh, writing down on my lecture notes and um, doing my practice problems. So I figured that wouldn't be too thrilling to watch for you guys. <laughs> But I'm back to vlogging today. I've been combining my daily vlogs because they've just been getting shorter and shorter just because I'm not like really doing much that's entertaining. I'm just kind of sitting at my desk studying <laughs> so they end up being very short. So I've just been combining them recently just to give you a longer vlog that you can sit and watch. Today is Constitutional Law Part 2. I have that lecture to do and then some practice problems to do, so yeah. It's later on in the day now and I'm going to run out to get a coffee because I don't have any milk or else I would make one here for myself and I'm too lazy to go to the store right now. I don't want to take the time out to do that. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Back from Starbucks now. Got an iced vanilla latte. Hi, Eloise. I also stopped at Office Max because I had to get printer ink and I have a bunch of stuff I need to print. So, got printer ink, but I also got some highlighters because those are running out as well. And I got these dividers for my binder. Thrilling, so I'm excited to use all my new supplies. <laughs> this is the thrill of the day. It's later on in the day now, but I just got my groceries delivered, so I'm going to put them away now. Ever since I discovered that I could get my groceries delivered to my apartment, I've just been doing that because I do not like going to the grocery store, especially when I'm busy and I feel like I don't have time to go like I have been these past couple of weekends. It's been really nice to just get them delivered. It only costs like $5 to get them delivered to me, which I would much rather pay than go to a busy grocery store to shop for like potentially two hours. Because <laughs> I always get all of my groceries in like one bulk for the week or two and then I'm good to go. But yeah, so I've just been getting them delivered now and I love it. I don't think I can ever go back, but I'm going to put these away now. Okay, groceries are done. Also going to fold this laundry that I just took out of the dryer now. Fun stuff. dinner. I'm making barbecue chicken with Brussels sprouts and white rice and I'm using this recipe that I found on Google. Let's see how it goes. First it says I have to marinate the chicken with olive oil, smoked paprika, lemon juice, and garlic. I don't have lemon juice, but I have everything else. Chicken in a bag, pouring it in. 
It says to keep that in the fridge for an hour, but I'm not gonna do that because I don't have time. <laughs> I'm gonna get hungry. Who are you talking to? My vlog. Look how tiny these Brussels sprouts are. They're like some of the smallest Brussels sprouts I've ever had. Brussels sprouts are in the oven. Got my chicken in a pan, putting it in the oven. I put salt and pepper on that too. Oh yes. And there is dinner. Oh yes. Ben with his long socks on. <laughs> it's later on now. I did some more work after I ate dinner and now I'm going to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Bye. Hi guys. It is bar prep day 10. And today we're doing Pennsylvania constitutional law. Oh, yes. I'm actually getting ready to go to the library right now. So I'm printing stuff out right now that I'll need at the library. I'm um, getting my books together. I put my binder together with my new tabs. And it's very satisfying. So <laughs> if you're into binders and stuff like that, then I'll show you that. Look at those tabs, so satisfying. So I have my MBE immersion, which I've already done. That was the first thing we did. Then I have evidence, which I've also already done. Pennsylvania evidence, which I've done. property, which I've done, constitutional law, which is partially done, and then Pennsylvania, I haven't printed that out yet, that's what I'm printing out now, but I have to print out PA con law, which we're doing today, PA DUI, which is also today, and then employment discrim is starting tomorrow on Thursday. But when I say I've done each of those subjects, I just mean that I've watched the lecture videos for those subjects because with Barbary, it's kind of an ongoing process. Like you'll watch one lecture video and then after that you'll take practice problems that could be related to the lecture video you just watched or it could be related to the lecture video you watched two days ago. So I think it's part of how they try to get you to learn is by getting you to relate back to things you had already done. So when I say I'm done with the topic, it doesn't mean I'm actually done with it. It just means I'm done with the lecture videos. I'm still continuing to do practice problems and essays and stuff like that. And I think that's how it will be until the exam. So I'm never actually done with a topic, just done with the lecture video. It's later on in the day now and I'm back from the library. I did not film at the library because it was crowded in there, but also quiet, so I didn't want to like have people looking at me filming being like, she's a weirdo, or having just the noise of my camera opening and closing in the library because it was quiet. So, didn't film in there, but I'm back now. I was at the library for probably like seven hours, now I am gonna take a shower, fold my laundry behind me, and then probably do another hour or two of work after that. But yeah, that's where I'm at right now. Eloise is being cute. She hates me.